welcome to my video review of the Team Fortress 2 action figure, The Engineer. Here we have The Engineer in his package, and here we have the back with some info on The Engineer. So let's get him out. This is The Engineer from Team Fortress 2. He constructs buildings that support the rest of the team, the most popular being the Sentry Gun, a turret that guards the area. His sculpt and paint job is one of the best so far in the series. He is very accurate to the game and is a very solid figure with a good range of articulation. Let's check out some details. The Engineer's face sculpt is really accurate to the game and well painted. On his shoulder we see the Engineer class icon. We have his right hand with his glove on and his left hand without glove. He has an extension cord on his belt, a pouch for holding things on his other side of his belt, you can insert anything that can fit. We have the engineer's knee pads, and finally, the boots. So let's see the articulation. The engineer has a ball jointed neck, jointed shoulder with good movement, a stiff elbow with little articulation, and a bit of minor wrist movement. He has a swivel at the torso, ball jointed thigh and double jointed knees. Lastly, we have some minor ankle articulation. So let's see what he comes with. First we have the pistol sidearm for the engineer. It's small and nicely painted. The engineer's wrench. And he comes with the toolbox. It's nicely painted red and has a few decals. It has a working handle and lock. You can fit a few items inside. Overall, the engineer is a very solid figure. Good paint job, great sculpt, and very accurate to the game. I would have loved a sentry gun to come with him, but maybe NECA will hold that off for the future. The engineer is one of my favorites from this series. The toolbox is a fun accessory, and whether you like Team Fortress or not, he will be a great figure to own. Thanks for watching.